who is owned by Greg Message called Beyond Driven. And Joe Snow is a 22 car for them. And watch him stand on the throttle here. Talk about somebody that can flat track one through the mud. This guy's getting it done. He's got a lot of great horsepower. And he is the guy that is the runner. It is up to the blockers and the crushers to slow him down. As you can see, they carry a lot of speed. Some of these guys with engines as big as 500 cubic inches inside of them, they are not afraid to run around here wide open, and they will run into each other wide open. And right there, he's lining up with that wall pretty good. That's Joe Snow. Once again, as you mentioned, he is the heavy hitter. This baby makes a lot of steam and a lot of power. I believe we're on board with Joe as well. He'll take, he'll take the wall. I think it was that move that upset him because watch this. He's about to take you for a ride. Sit back in your chair because oh, look at that. Woo! I mean, head on, baby, oh. at about 50 miles an hour. It's hard as he knew how to get it done. Man, both those drivers took hard hits. I thought they were coming through the windshield. Oh, Joe Snow back in the car. <laughs> He's trying to make that track a little bit bigger, man. He missed that car, tried to take out the wall, and that left the team captain to run around and finish this one out in round one action. Car number 21, that is Greg Messick, and he brought Team Beyond Driven home as a round one winner. That's exactly right, and by the way, these teams have more than one car for each other. So as they make the way through round robins of racing, they got plenty of them left in reserve 